In this tutorial, you'll learn how to build floating labels in your forms in Bootstrap 5. Okay, so then we have this. Now what we want in the body is actually a form. And then we have an input here with a floating label, which means that when you make it focused, the label um, appears to move up here. So then we have that input. Then we just have an input um, element. And the type is actually email. The class here is going to be one of bootstraps. So it's going to be form control as they call it. Now we want to have that floating label. So we do need a label as well. So to connect that, we need to give this an ID of, let's say, uh, email, or email one, email one. And this can be email address. Okay. Now you need to wrap this to make this a floating, uh, uh, to, to make this float basically in the input, we can wrap this in a new element with a bootstrap class called form floating. That's how bootstrap does it. You wrap it in, a, in, a, in an element with a class of form floating. So then let's see. So then we have this um, input, but now the label is already floating here. It's always floating. So we actually need to add a placeholder. So this can be anything actually, because it's using the placeholder uh, functionality of the browser to make that work. So it doesn't really matter what you type here. Um, but it, that's necessary for how this works under the hood, right? So now we have a very cool floating effect. By the way, if this was helpful, I'd really appreciate it if you could like and subscribe. Also, check out my courses on CSS and JavaScript if you want to take those skills to an advanced level. Because in there, we will build some beautiful real-world projects from scratch so you can see how everything fits together and really master CSS or JavaScript. And I will also release other courses soon like React and Node.js. So if you want to be notified, then make sure you are subscribed to the email newsletter. You can find the link in the description. Thanks for watching and I hope to see you soon.